Hi everyone, today we're going to look at the Play-Doh Spaghetti Factory, where it allows you to make different types of spaghetti and pasta for Play-Doh. So you can make bow tie noodles, uh, I don't even know what you call it, ganaches, I think, spaghetti, and a whole bunch of other different things. So you can make this yummy bowl of pasta, all with the pasta maker. So let's see how to do it. So first, we're going to make some spaghetti. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to fill up this little tube with Play-Doh. Now, this will take some assembly, but it's not that hard. So you got to make sure that you put the little spiral in it, or the screw, put the plate on top, and then have it lined up so that you can actually push it through. Now, we're going to push down on these two green tabs, and you're going to see the spaghetti coming out. So I'm pushing down, and out comes the spaghetti. So here we have it. And you can just simply twist. And now this is the square kind. If you want, you can use the bowl here. And on the bottom of it, you can see that you can make round spaghetti. So it depends on what kind of pasta you want. Now I'll call it spaghetti, but it's really just pasta. Now you would take this back out. So you would unscrew it here at the bottom, and then push in order to get the whole thing out so that you can clean it. And you'd be ready for your next thing of pasta. Now, so this is how you make the spaghetti itself, is with the pasta maker, but you can also make other kinds of things with the molds, and we're going to see those next. Okay, so on the bottom of the bowl, you can see the different cutouts for the different things you can make. And so you can make different types of noodles, like right here, and uh, kind of like a raviolis right there. Um, you've got little shapes. I'm going to call it a pepperoni, but it's actually kind of a half a meatball, which you make right here, and a whole different other things. Now, you can also make different pasta shapes right on the bottom. And you can make, actually these are more vegetables, so you have your, um, I'm going to call that a basil leaf maybe, I guess. A mushrooms, cauliflower, um, I always say this wrong, I think it's kenoshi. These little pastas, bow tie pastas, and everything else. And you can also make, again, more, more of a ravioli right here by just pushing it in. And on the other side, you can make more of a, a true round meatball by putting your play-doh in and pushing down. Now on the other bowl, which we have right here, you look on the bottom and you can make even more things. You can make drumsticks, you can make um, uh, little pieces that look like steaks, so here's the drumstick, um, and a whole bunch of different um, types of pasta. And when you're done, you put it all together and you have something like this. Now we can put some of the red, the, orange pasta that we made in there and you take your fork and your spoon which it comes with and you're ready to dig in on your bowl of pasta we can put a little meatball on top so that gives you an idea of all the different things you can make with the spaghetti factory by Play-Doh Okay, a few final thoughts on the Play-Doh Spaghetti Factory. I'm going to give it four and a half stars. Cleanup's not too hard, and it's one of the Play-Doh sets that can be done by younger children. So even younger kids can do it. It's also pretty fun. Um, and if you don't want to make spaghetti, you can always say that they're worms or snakes or other things. Maybe even hair. But, uh, but it's designed to be, of course, spaghetti. It does come with the fork and the spoon, two bowls and lots of opportunities for making different kinds of pasta other than just spaghetti. So if you have any questions, please let me know, and I'd be happy to try to answer them. So take care, and have a great day.